Hey guys, MTK Shady here, and I'm back with another Beyblade Burst unboxing. This time we have Atlas Anubion. Here is a very quick look around the box. Inside the box we get the instruction sheet, the ripcord, and the launcher, and the Beyblade. So first, we're going to talk about the driver since, well, the launcher is the same. So the driver is called Orbit. That is because it has this free-spinning ball here. And it was supposed to come with Wild Wyvron and it didn't, so it came with Alice Anubia. It's really good though. Here we have the Yell Disc. The Yell Disc is a very, well, it's basically a ninja star surrounded by a ring. And it was really good in the Takara Tomy format, well, as long as it lasted before the, the frames and core disc came out. It was really good and hopefully it's just as good in the Hasbro format. Finally, we have the layer. Anubion A2, also known as Atlas Anubion. Atlas Anubion is a very, very round Beyblade, and it has some ears, and it's basically an Anubis, it has an Anubis motif. Here is the QR code for those who want it. Anyway, now let's put it together and see how tight it is. Alright, time to put it together. So first we're going to put the disc on, as you all know, you should all know how to put it together. But I'm going to do this one hand, I'm going to try to do it one hand, and we'll see how it is. Ah, uh, okay, it's pretty hard with one hand. But uh, anyway, that was, I'm going to tell you guys how tight it is now. So, um, it's not really that tight, actually. It's actually really loose. Pretty loose. Not that loose, but it should survive some hits before it bursts. But yeah, that's Atlas Anubia, and it looks really, really nice. It looks really, really nice, that's for sure. And yeah, I won't be having a test fence time in Ottawa right now, so yeah. So, with all that said, this is the first time in an MDK Shady video, we're gonna give a verdict. The layer is extremely accurate, and it comes with, with an orbit driver, which is really good. And if you're looking for a Beyblade that can survive some nice hits, this is the one for you. And yeah, Atlas and Nubion is a very, very good release, and I will definitely recommend this to pretty much any Beyblader who wants Hathor Beyblades. Atlas and Nubion is a good Bey. That's all from me, I'll see you guys next time.